exhibit is an opportunity for us, a group of 13 young women, to share our different perspectives with you. We welcome you to our exhibit and ask you to share the magic of the stories and these photos, which express joy, passion, positivity, and hope. Depending on your own perspective, these photos will tell a story specific to you, your experience, and your views on the world. Regardless of age, the way one views the world is the way we all create moments. It is my pleasure to be part of the Houston team for today's launch of the photo exhibit Looks Like Us. Um, you know, our public spaces is where we gather and uh, COVID has made that that much more important. We recognize that when we come out, we want to be safe or we want to be together. So the sense of community is, uh, is what we always long for. And what could be more extraordinary than actually coming into the open space, but also seeing public artwork and how we can actually transform the space. The 27 photos in this exhibit documenting the human experience during this global pandemic were taken by female photographers from around the world and the collection was curated by 13 young women from this neighborhood. This extraordinary exhibit located on three sites throughout the Esplanade was made possible through a wonderful collaboration between JAMI and the global collective of more than 400 women photographers called The Journal. Many of the participating photographers expressed how honored and grateful they were to have their photos chosen through such a process. I hope you can hear our collective thank you. And so through this process, the girls were able to share the images that you see today by connecting to how they made them feel and also by amplifying their own voices and the women that are sharing these photos today. Uh, the photo where, uh, you know, we see someone here who's, you know, in PPE, but like emerging out of the water, uh, you know, gives me hope that, you know, we're going to emerge out of uh, the pandemic that we're in and be able to leave. Um, you know, that PPE hopefully behind someday when we're on the other side of this <laughs> pandemic and break free of it. Uh, and I, I really love that so much. To have a physically distanced art outing right now in the middle of this pandemic is so good for all of us because art feeds our souls. And it's an opportunity for us to tell, for people to tell their stories. And the stories that are not told often enough are the stories of women and young women, you know. And so what you're doing here today is giving a voice to, to people that whose stories need to be heard more often.